The PhD of spirituality is love. Usually we master all other things first before we totally are able to master the ability to be loving. So today, on this Valentine's week, we're going to pray to become more loving. Let us pray. First of all, we pray for our imagination. May we imagine all people loving to us. May we not play the victim in past events or current events. May we see all people in our life as loving objects to us, that they are wonderful, and in our imaginations of other people, how they have treated us in the past, how they treat us today, or imagined how they will treat us tomorrow. We imagine the best. We're deserving of love. We're God's children. And in that moment, we accept love fully. And we are infilled with love. We are infilled with love by God. And in that infilling, we overflow to give it to others. And we give it freely. We are a vessel of love. This body temple that you're wearing is the temple of love. And you overflow to all people. Anyone that comes into your sight will be in the sight of God's love. Everything about you is changing, evolving, and being made new. Inside of your mind, you are a loving person, thinking of all people in love and in the highest possible aspect. You are a loving person in the way that you wear your face and your body language. You are absolutely broadcasting out God's love to all people. Those that you know, co-workers, family, friends, and those that you do not know along the street. Wherever you are, you are bringing love into that situation. And all people are attracted to this because all people need this. You are truly giving the world what it needs. You are becoming a valentine to everyone. And in the equipping of God's love inside of your mind, inside of your body, there is a new tone to your voice. It is an accepting tone. It is a tone that surrounds, enfolds other people and makes them feel glad, makes them feel loved. You are holding this thought about all others inside of your mind, and you're holding this thought about yourself. You realize that you are more than you were before this prayer, that you are equipped with the God-given gift of pure love coming through you, touching you first and overflowing from you onto all others. And you willingly do this. You do not hold it back. You do not put a, a gas pedal to it and a brake to it. You allow it to flow. And you become a new creature in Christ, in Christ's love. Inside of you, you are created new. You are created with an energy and a vitality for giving love. And inside of your hands, you have a new ability to touch that will uplift another. When you shake a hand, when you touch a shoulder, when you hug, there's going to be something behind the physical move that is something of God that will bless and leave its permanent mark of good. Inside of the way that you act, there will be a new power to act and proact in love. Everything you do will be for love and in love, and you will, in this way, 
become someone that is a light to your world. You are willing, you are wanting to do this. On this Valentine's week, you dedicate yourself to this permanent change, not just for this week, but for a lifetime. May you be the type of person that spreads joy and love wherever you go. And may you be the type of person that also accepts love from others. You do not put it through a screen of human emotions. You simply say, yes, I accept. And yes, I give. And in this way, there is a perfect circulation of all the good of God love in and through your life to others, to yourself. And I pray that your life, because of your actions and your mental conditioning, becomes a heaven on earth. In Jesus Christ's name, we pray. Amen.